Have you ever felt like your business was in a slump and you were just really unmotivated? I'm going to show you how to fix that instantly. Think about the benefits and not the difficulties. A common problem that I see is that uh, we tend to think about how hard something is. For instance, I need to learn to program a website. That's actually not hard for me. I've done that a million times and I'm kind of like a technical person. So uh, maybe that's not a good example for me, but let's take exercise for, for instance. Exercise sounds really hard. Just thinking about it makes me tired. Um, so I keep like, I can get like in this rut in my mind, thinking about um, how hard it is and it tires me out. So I'm go I'm, I have learned to train my brain to think about the, the benefits. And, and whenever I go into, oh, it's so hard, I kind of switch it around. Like I flip a switch and I start, oh, don't do that. Think about what this would give you. So instead of thinking about it is hard and I'm going to feel tired, I'm going to get sweaty and, and all of that. Think about, oh, I'm going to have so much energy. I'm going to be slimmer. I'm going to feel stronger. And, and train your mind to not go into that loop of negative thinking, but going into a positive thinking spiral. And it will really motivate you and keep you out of that slump. So I hope you enjoyed this strategy for pulling you out of a slump and getting you motivated again. But I have nine other strategies that you can take a look at. So just click in the link in the description and you will get my nine other um, strategies for getting out of a slump and getting motivated. Have a great day. Thank you for listening or watching this content. I hope it has brought you some value. I hope it's been inspiring or motivating or given you some kind of new idea to maybe get out of a rut or maybe really go and crush it. Listen, I'm just an ex-computer programmer who uh, got into a car crash back in 2001 and it took me several years to get out of that. And during that time, I studied everything there was to study about spirituality and personal growth. And finally, I found my way to uh, finding my passion, and that is online marketing and online business building. To That's the platform that I really love to help inspire people to create the life and the freedom that they want in their life and build a legacy and impact the world for the better. Now, if you want to follow me on this journey, you can find me on social media or go to my blog askmarilina.com that's askmarilina.com and i hope to see you in another episode bye for now